आरबीआई के पूर्व गवर्नर सी रंगराजन ने कहा कि जीएसटी इकोनॉमी के लिए एक बड़ा इवेंट था और जहां तक ग्रोथ में धीमेपन की बात है उसकी सबसे बड़ी वजह में से एक है कि प्राइवेट इन्वेस्टमेंट नहीं के बराबर आ रहा है उनसे एक्सक्लूसिव बातचीत की प्रकाश प्रियदर्शी ने the fall in growth rate has also been accompanied by a decline in private uh, investment rate therefore the primary focus uh, should be on uh, activating private investment and getting private investment going um, to some extent public investment and capital expenditures on the part of the government will help and uh, it has already increased Uh, over the last uh, few years uh, but the main thing is to focus on private uh, uh, investment um, and uh, uh, some of the things that can be done immediately are one um, there are quite a few stalled projects um, and uh, the government must take action uh, to see that the obstacles that come in the way of the projects being completed are removed and enable the, the private sector to complete such as those stalled projects which are viable um second uh, the banks need to be capitalized so that uh, the uh, they can begin to lend again um, because what we now have are universal banks the banks provide both short term and long term credit uh, the inability to provide credit has also affected long term uh, credit therefore recapitalization of the banks must uh, be on the top of the agenda uh, in order to reactivate banks and by reactivating banks reviving private uh, investment some people says if government has taken a decision of uh, demonetization then after the gst uh, the implementation of gst should be delayed so do you think it is like a double whammy for the economy GST is an important tax reform um and it has been talked about for several years um when such a fundamental reform is introduced there will always be some glitches there will always be problems uh whatever be the time at which it is introduced these problems will be there for two quarters uh, consequently it has been around 5.6% 5.7% um therefore it looks like the downward trend as bottomed out but however um, even if the economy were to grow at 7% for the next three quarters the overall growth rate for the year will only be 6.5% therefore my estimate is probably for the year as a whole the growth rate may be around 6.5%